So zombie. Yeah, zombie. And One of my favourite songs in in I was staggering for the dark. It's just just a really cool feel. Quite a different vibe. Yeah, um, with, sure. the, with the rest of the songs. And I think it's quite a strong opener as well to I Was Stabbing for the Dog Until You Found Me. This started like 2015. Yeah, we had the bass line. We had that and we had that one verse. And we had that one verse. Yeah. That was there for ages. The beginning. That's the first verse. That was the first yeah, verse, yeah. 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 Uh, we had the pre-chorus, we had the bam 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 We had a, a, an idea, but then we were trying to figure out the chorus. Uh, we had a different vibe, it was like You should let me love you Hold you You should let me hold you that. Uh, that was kind of scrapped straight away. And we kept trying to write to it and then nothing would really come. So we will park it and then we'll come and revisit it again. And I remember this one moment where we were in the studio with Tim, the producer. We couldn't write anything, so we said, oh, let's just try and develop it musically. And then we added this middle eight kind of Stevie Wonder break. Oh, that's 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 with the harpsichord or whatever it's called. Oh, what? <laughs> what? Yeah. No, clav. It yeah, was a club, yeah, yeah, funny, because every time we listened to it, we would just be laughing. But actually, we used some See, elements of it, put it in, in the final uh, recording of it. But we were struggling for quite some time, so we thought, you know what, let's call our friend Josh Green. To come and help us out. Josh has this ability to find melodies and all that kind of stuff. So he came and spent the day with us, and we looked at the song, and he actually came with... Um, with the melody for the pre-chorus. How does it go? What the hell am I feeling inside? Looking for signs of life, got me so paralyzed. What the hell am I feeling inside? So he came up with this and the oh oh oh. So he came with that and we're like, oh that's really cool. And as we developed the song and as we started kind of giving a bigger picture of, of the hour staggering for the dark we decided to call it Zombie. We wanted to give that, yeah. start looking at Michael Jackson Thriller and just kind of that vibe, looking at uh, Childish Gambino. And it just thought it was like a really strong opener because life and stuff we talk about later on in the album with, you know, with like the song Crazy. And you know, mm. like you, you finally, you met God and you know, people call me crazy, but you know, it, do, it doesn't matter. The song like Electric Feeling, like I was staggering, it's just, it's a party. Yeah. So you wanted like to open the record with something of just talking about like, oh, what was it like before almost? Mm. And so the, the, the song Zombies like of, of, you're just sort of trying to, trying to make your way through life mm. and you're just kind of, you're a zombie, you're not really living. Not you're really just, living. You're just, you're just sort of existing in this earth. And yeah. once until we, we met Jesus that, that we finally start to live. You find true life and life is only with Jesus. That was kind of like the, the background to to that particular song. And once we kind of figured that out, the stuff started to develop a lot easier, wasn't once it? Once we unlocked the theme of yeah. what we were trying yeah, to say. Yeah, yeah. And then we started trying to put some effects in there, to kind of like the thunder, the, the, ooh, yeah, the, the werewolves, the, that was a very good job. The werewolf stuff. And then in the middle late, we're just trying to capitalize on, on Lucy's vocals, especially with the this is my prayer, and it's like big belter. And when when is when is go on, give us go, go. This is my prayer. Uh, <laughs> this is my prayer. Uh, and, and this gave us one opportunity for Jacob to jump on bass. Um, what I like, used to do when he was a kid. Um, <laughs> sure. 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 <laughs> that was a kid. <laughs> like that. This is an opportunity for Jacob to jump on bass again, just like his dad, who was his big hero. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not funny, it's not funny. Uh, opportunity for Jacob to, to jump on bass. <laughs> 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 is that funny? Um, it's just a different vibe, and even when we're playing live, it's, it's just really cool. <laughs> <laughs> even when we're playing live, it's really fun, the fact that I get to jump on bass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm waiting for you guys to start laughing, so. Start, right, your turn, Joe. What I really like about this song is it gave Jacob the opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the really cool thing with this song. Stop it! I really say yes. Ooh. All right. You okay? <laughs>
Okay, good. And a really cool thing is I get to play bass live with this <laughs> song, which is cool. What was really great about this song is just being able to try some new stuff, like we did that weird instrumental at the end, yeah. and getting Lucy's yeah. vocal, trying some different drum stuff, and then Jacob being able to switch from playing the electric guitar to playing the bass. Which in the show looks pretty cool. Um, it's cool to just try something new and different. Mm. Zombie, Zombie is probably, is probably one of my favourite songs, to not yeah, only to perform, too. but to, yeah. to listen to as well. It's great, so mm. that is, that's Zombie. Hey guys, thank you for watching our video. Subscribe, like the video, all that good stuff. See you guys later.